I moved uh, um, down to Atlanta about 15 years ago. Uh, just with my my family. Uh, my dad relocated. He got a job with the CDC, so the whole family moved from Chicago to Atlanta. Um, so right now, basically, Atlanta is is the place I call home, and um, I love this city, and uh, it's given me so many opportunities. Uh, it's just uh, it's really nurturing to artists, and there's just a, a certain um, certain opportunity that you have that you can really like reach the goals that you want. We the Creators is a web series that I did uh, just to sort of change the people's definition of art and um, artists and creatives. Um, I interviewed uh, a bunch of uh, artists from all different art forms, from martial arts to culinary arts to painters and dancers. So I just wanted to, you know, cover a wide spectrum of art and artists. And, um, just make it very diverse. So I, uh, the plan was to shoot them in a very cinematic fashion. Um, I was a big fan of uh, documentaries like Baraka, Sansara, um, basically cinematic documentaries that didn't need words. Last year I did a documentary called More Than Music Senegal. And it was a documentary that took place in Senegal, West Africa. And it was about uh, a group of hip hop artists and journalists who got together and um, formed up just basically were able to change the whole uh, layout of the political layout out there. Um, there was a president who was trying to amend the constitution and give himself extra terms and these people like got together and mobilized about 500,000 people to vote, um, spoke out, did all types of peaceful protests and were able to get this guy out of office when he was trying to like do everything to stay in there and it was really cool because it was like right off the back of like all the Arab uh, uprisings in like uh, Egypt and um, it, it just really uh, showed like the power of hip-hop and also you know um, in the in the film I show some other things that they do with hip-hop like uh, education they, have, um, they do teaching through hip-hop they also have a news program through hip hop that's like you know two guys sitting behind two news anchors sitting behind a desk with like all the, the stories from the news, but they're spitting all the news through hip hop um, in both French and Wolof, the Senegalese local, uh, one of the Senegalese local languages. So I, I just thought it was pretty cool and um, just an awesome showcase for like the power of hip hop if you choose to use it. Um, there's a uh, really like conscious and political and uh, motiv motivational power and something that mobilizes a lot of people too. So I just thought that was pretty important. So check that out. Um, it's, I think it's been on the festival run for like a year, a year, a year and a half maybe. So um, I'm actually probably going to be releasing it for free online pretty soon. So uh, be on the lookout.